what's up guys this morning we're just gonna try a little duck hunt uh, we got about two days left in the season here in Virginia and uh, this morning it's cold and blowing it's blowing about 18 to 20 right now um, this is supposed to be our uh, snow of the century kind of deal we're supposed to have this big blizzard or whatever I didn't really see it this morning I only had four inches at the house and probably less here where I'm at now but anyway we're gonna uh, get loaded up get the decoys out and get set up and uh, get ready for shooting light hopefully this morning my cameras cooperate I've tried to film this a few times and uh, it's been so cold my cameras have been freezing up uh, they just wouldn't do anything so we had a couple good shoots here um, I think we've killed I don't know two different trips I don't know maybe eight wood ducks uh, I think between three trips um, between two people and uh, we haven't been seeing too many mallards, a lot of wood ducks in here. Um, one or two geese occasionally, but they usually don't want to cooperate in here. But we'll, we'll see this morning, we'll give it a try. Um, gonna put out about two dozen decoys, two and a half dozen decoys. And uh, then we're gonna set up in this uh, beaver pond, kind of a slough, and uh, see what happens. All right, stay tuned. All right, so we got all the decoys put out and uh, we got about, I don't know, 25 minutes before shooting light here. So I'm going to sit here and have a bit of coffee, try to stay warm, try to keep my cameras warm so they'll actually film this morning, and we'll see what happens. Wish me luck. All right, so I'm hoping I got all that on video. The Tacticam was running, the GoPro was running. Um, we had a pile of wood ducks dumping here this morning, first thing. Um, probably 15. Um, I killed two wood ducks, and then uh, a pair of mallards came in, and I shot a mallard, Drake, which was really cool. First mallards I've seen, and first mallard I've taken all year. Um, and then of course, as it always is, I uh, get in the kayak to go pick up the birds and uh, was looking for another one um, that I thought may have been hit or whatever. And uh, of course another pair of mallards fly over and they pick me right out in that kayak. So that's just how it goes. But anyway, hopefully the cameras caught everything because that was cool. Um, so far, things are going great. Um, the GoPro died. It keeps freezing. I've got a hot hands on it. Now I've got it in my pocket with three, trying to warm it back up so it'll start recording again. Um, so we'll see. Hopefully everything uh, everything's on video. This is tough video and your own uh, duck hunt. Um, for the people that do it well, I give them props because it is not easy. It really isn't. Trying to get it on video and uh, you know manage to call the ducks in, get them to decoy or whatever, and then get the shot on video. That is hard. It's really hard to do so anyway hopefully this time i actually got it on video and uh we'll see there's part of my spread 
Then I've got a few over here that you can't see. A couple over here and some more up there trying to kind of box in this water hole. So it's a beautiful morning, spitting snow, really, really good wind. So I'm hoping some more ducks will keep flying. Tops of the trees are just whipping up there and it, it'll gust up to like, I don't know, probably 30, 35. So hopefully the birds will keep flying at least for a while. All right, guys, I'm gonna call that a wrap. I had a great day. Uh, best shoot I've had in a while. Ended up with three wood ducks and a mallard. I'll take a wood duck limit, and especially the mallard. Uh, first one I've shot this year, and tomorrow's the last day. So it tells you how uh, the year's been so far. But uh, it has been cold this morning. I think it's like 28 degrees with a 20 to 30 mile an hour wind. Plenty of snow on the ground, as you can see by my truck. Uh, but yeah, it was a good day. And it's, you know how it goes. Right as I'm picking up decoys, about 25 mallards flew over. and They worked me about two or three passes and then uh, they decided they didn't want the parts of it. and They kept flying, but it was still a good day. I saw a pile of wood ducks. Uh, saw quite a few mallards. And uh, like I said, that last group that went over, there was probably 25 in that. So that was, that's good to see. Uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll we'll have a good day and Josh can come with me and get in on the uh, action a little bit. So hopefully everything came out on video okay. Um, this cold weather has been giving my cameras a fit. I'm trying to uh, keep them from freezing up because they just absolutely lock up. And then they won't turn on. They won't do anything. So hand warmers on the cameras, you know, Keep them inside my jacket with the hand warmers when uh, when I'm not running them or whatever, trying to keep them warm. But it's been tough. This has been uh, probably the toughest challenge hunting-wise that I've ever had. Um, hunting ducks in Virginia is tough, anyways, to find you know any decent amount of birds. Um, but trying to film it, film a solo hunt, let me tell you, that is tough. That has been a big challenge, and uh, I like the challenge. I'm getting better. Hopefully, uh, I got a you know got all this on video. And the cameras worked okay and i didn't have any problems if not it'll be a short and sweet video so <laughs> anyway uh, if you like this video uh, hit that subscribe button hit that like button comment let me know what you think i know the calling's a little rough it's only my second year uh duck hunting and we're working on it but uh takes time um takes a lot of practice and a lot of uh hunting to try to figure out uh these ducks and then as soon as you think you do they do something different and change up on you and everything goes out the window so anyway Hope you like the video, and we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks, guys.